it begins. Long ago, two races ruled over the earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Emmett, 2010X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Welcome to Undertale! I have Twizzlers. Um, so, where to begin? Uh, this game, uh, I could, I, I can, I can jack off to this game. Not really, but you can find things about this game to jack off to. Um, in, in, in complete honesty. I ignore the white bar, I was just moving the window. Um, second off, these Twizzlers are really nice. Twizzlers, you can pay me for that, you know, plug. Thirdly, I know a lot of people are very skeptical about this game. Especially since it's very popular, it's very, um, like, talked about, very hyped, and a lot of people are skeptical about that. And it's also a red flag for people is that everyone says not to look up anything about this game before you start playing it. Which is, I will add, very important because this game is an experience you need to experience everything about it yourself in one go however i'm gonna try and win over some of you skeptic folk namely you guys a few of you guys i talked to who i haven't broken down and you know but I, I apologize for the pauses i've been eating twizzlers oh god um hopefully this will be an enjoyable experience. I'm going to play up into a particular point, and then I will end the recording, and I will let you guys decide whether you think this game is um, just as amazing as I make it out to be if you talk to me on a day-to-day -day basis, how much I circle jerk over this game, or you decide if you hate it and continue watching me play since you just want to see what it's all the fuck about. So, you know, you can either be, you know, cool and get the game or be wrong. I'm joking, everyone has their own opinion. In any case... I accidentally closed the game. Do 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 Matt Damon! Anyway... Yeah, yeah, we just get the... These are the controls. Fairly simple, you don't need to use your mouse. Which I really like, and it also has controller configuration as well. But, preferably... I find it easier to use the keyboard. It's all up to you. So, let's jump right on into it. Let's name our fallen human. What shall we name them? <laughs> no. I'm gonna name it you. No, I'm gonna name it them. No, I'm trying to make it seem like it's like putting you, the viewer, in the spot since you're gonna be. Ex if you if you decide to be wrong and watch me play this entire game, I'll just put the name them and then I will correct it in sentences. I guess actually then, at that point, you would be better. 
Gonna be that second person, you know. Is this name correct? You? We're Asian! That's racist, I'm sorry. Speaking of racist... I'm a small Korean child in the early stages of jaundice. You know... I, I, I played this game. I know everything about it, but I'm gonna try and act surprised. So... I also initially did not know you could do this, and just kinda like... Uh, I guess this is my life here now. Howdy! I'm Flowey! Flowey the flower! Hmm... You're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly! You must be so confused! That's my new voice for him. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go! He's Jewish. That's also racist. Nope. One. See that heart? That's your soul, the very culmination of your being. Could you plots? I know nothing about Jewish. Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong if you gain a lot of love. What's love stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you, sweetie? Uh. Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through these little war friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. It's like phasing between like Jewish, like a stereotypical Jewish voice and like a surfer and someone desperately trying not to shit themselves, but someone just won't stop talking to them. Hey buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets! Friendliness pellets. Okay. You idiots. Okay. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That's gonna kill my throat. <coughs> Excuse me. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Okay. Die! <laughs> this is my life now, I guess. Oh. Goodbye. <coughs> Excuse me, let's go, Mom! What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, uh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come. Uh, oh. I'm sorry. I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. That was a coming joke, by the way. Because I'm a mature individual. The shadow of the ruins looms ahead. Above. I'm dyspraxic, dyslexic, everything. Filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Because <laughs> I'm mature. This is a mature playthrough. Welcome to your no new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Yay! Yeah, she did it! The ruins are filled of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. There, I adjusted my sight to them. To make progress here, oh god, I made myself lightheaded. You'll have to, you'll need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones you need to flip. By the way, you should read these signs. Anything that's out of the ordinary, you should read. But I'm not going to, so that you can explore on your own. But I will start exploring shit after I get past the point that I... mentioned <coughs> Morty. Like, it's fairly obvious. Like, Splendid! Whoops, I, I, I started talking in me. Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. I'm sorry, but I have multiple personality disorder. Let's move to the next room. As a human living in the underground, Monsters may attack you. 
you need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. Twizzler in my mouth. Ugh. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you're in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Here, I'm talking to the dummy. Do you need some ideas for conversation topics? Skip, 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 Because I don't want you guys reading that. <laughs> you can read it yourself. Just talk to her, fat ass. Oh, okay. This is the combat menu. You fight for soulless, sadistic creatures, act, and mercy for those of you who have a heart, and items. I don't have items. Instead, right now it just does. So let's act, dummy. Let's check them out. <clears throat> dummy, attack zero, defense zero. A cotton heart and a button eye. You are the apple of my eye. And you're a fucking retard for rhyming eye with eye, Dr. Dre. Stands around absentmindedly. Oh, da damn it, I did it again. Talk. You talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won! You earned zero gold and zero experience. Ah, very good. You are very good. We are very good. <coughs> that pizza I had earlier was very good, apparently. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. She just had, like, a fucking spasm. Oh, jeez! It's a... Frog it. You thought I was gonna say faggot. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna act. Or, no, you know what? Mercy him. Spare him. Because I am a good individual. I was looking down for a minute and Toriel decided to give him the stare of death. This is the puzzle, but... Here. Take my hand for a moment. She just trips midway. Oh shit! <laughs> when you steal her clothing. Cause that's what you do when someone dies in front of you, right? Y you steal their clothing. You don't? Um... Well, there's a first time for everyone to learn something. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. I read that really late cause I wasn't paying attention. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like to walk to the you to walk to the end of this room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Wait, go, Bob. Go, Bob. Stop. Stop. Jesus Christ, you're so fast. Ugh. I'll, I'll, I'll catch up with you later. Can I leave? What happens if I go back? Oh, I can't. Well, that sucks, I want it. Damn you, Toby Fox! You didn't think of everything, but you thought of like 85% of everything. This is a long ass hallway. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have any ne need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Wait, is this a f is this a 4S or a 5? If you press C, you could open your menu and you see cell, and it'll tell it you could talk to her. And like, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that. You guys can do that. Ring. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that haven't yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good, all right? <coughs> Whatever, bitch. 
playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. That's the best part. Oh god. <coughs> Whimson approached meekly. Goodbye. I want to do too much fighting here. It says take one. Take a piece of candy? Yes. Took a piece of candy. Yeah. Ooh, piece of candy. Take one. I am a good boy. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. Alright, Bruce Wayne. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they may not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Like, the way those words are colored, I'm pretty sure everyone looks at it like that as, like, like one of those fill-of-the-blanks, like, when a pharmacy calls you to let you know your prescription's ready. Yeah, we learned that stepping on these makes them crack. Because they're cracked. Ring. Hello, this is Toriel. I have no one else on my contacts! For n at no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Ugh. <sighs> I'm gonna be ostrated for this, or like, lynched, but I have not tried either of these things on their own. But, I know what cinnamon tastes like, from like artificial- like, this is based off of my knowledge of artificial flavoring, so I like biscotch! Oh, I see. Thank you very much. The fucking- Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but- would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Like... Push. Don't you just fuck it- oh god. Ah. I just hate it when people are like- Like this! Get it all out in the first phone call, Jesus. Using up my minutes. You do not have any allergies, do you? Huh? Why am I asking? No reason, no reason at all. Just get the dick ready. I'm gonna do this in one go. Oh, oh god. Mold small and mold small block away. Run! Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? You're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Am I being hit on by a rock? I'm a child! This rock- RAPE! Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Aren't you smarmy ass rock? Hmm? That was the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Thank you, you fucking bitch. Hmm. You want me to stay there? Give me a real workout. Thank you. D Thank you. I would have been dead. What a prick. <gasps> it's a mouse. Anyway, knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese fills you with determination. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. You. I see someone's late for their Ku Klux Klan meeting. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to be asleep. Move it with force. <laughs> here comes Zaps the Blook. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit, what do I do? What do I, uh, well first, you should, if you're going to be kind, go to act. Let's... Let's cheer him up. He looks kind of sad with the twinkly eyes. Gave Naps to block a patient smile. Ugh. <laughs> Naps to block looks just a little bit better. As you can see, there's like different, like, options. So... Experiment in battle, don't just do what I'm doing. He told Naps to block a little joke. <laughs> Sorry, not feeling up to it right now. 
I can't read things correctly, apparently. <sighs> and I'm tired at 8.05 p.m. Naps the block wants to show you something. Let me try. <laughs> Is it a mature stream? Or mature recording? I call it Dapper Block. Do you like it? Fuck yeah, I like your cum hat! Oh, jeez. I usually came to the ruins because nobody's around. Well, today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Now I feel sad because I wasted that voice on him. Leave 7G in the net? I don't have 7G. Make sure that you talk to every- If something's in the overworld, you can talk to it. Oh god, MIGOPS, crawl close! Goodbye. I will start actually fighting shit once I get past the point that I wanted to. Hello? I just realized it's been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There's probably a lot of things lying around here and there. You could pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something that you'll really like. You will want to have leave room in your pockets for that. She's got a point. A lot of bitchin' shit around here you don't want to miss. For instance... This umbilical cord! You found a faded ribbon. Oh god. Vegetoid! Kakarot! Urgh! God damn it, Nappa! That kills my throat, too. Yep, you see, I have a puzzle master. I'm not gonna explain this puzzle. Actually, I should. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks the rotation in perspective. You should keep that wide. Keep your eye on the butt plugs, people. Oh god. Big ops. Please. What, what, what do we do? If you can read this, press the blue switch. To switch, press it. Yes. Oh, oh you fuck. I, I, I don't I don't know if I mentioned it during the Naps the Block fight, but the combat in this game, if you can read this, press the red switch, is based on bullet hell. Oh god. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna act on Mold Small. Just, you know, so you guys can see. You lie immobile with Mold Small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. Legion, we are Legion. Ha huh, ha. Huh. If you have more than one enemy, they both attack at once. Mold Small waits pensively. Spam. B and B is the best. Spam. You see, you gotta find a way to get... To, to, to get... Yeah. Uh, the frog in an earlier room explained it, but... It's a butt plug. Press it? Yes. Uh, w the, in that room, the long hallway with the frogs, the two frogs... If you talk to the last one, he tells you about that. Like the, you know, if their name's yellow, you can spare them. Also, if the spare option is yellow, then you can spare one of uh, you can spare one of the monsters on the field. Oh Jesus! Looks and Co decided to pick on you. Bye. Shaka, what's going on over here? Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me, I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit. I'm gonna kill my fucking throat. Ooh, a knife. You found a toy knife. Faded ribbon. You equip the ribbon. Yep, there's always- every area in this game has stuff to find, especially new weapons and new armor. You don't have to use the weapons, but if you want, you can have them, just to have them. Armor increases, uh, decreases how much damage you take, and weapons increase how much uh, damage you do. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought. What's up, bitch? 
How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Not a scratch. Impressive. But still... <laughs> MLG Pro! I should not have left you alone for so long. I feel disgusting for doing that. I'm so sorry. It was irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I can't hide it any longer. Come, small one. I was gonna make a cum joke again, but I decided against it. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Save every chance you get, people. There's nothing wrong with doing it. Do you smell that? I shit on the floor. Surprise! You stepped in it. It is the butterscotch cr uh, cinnamon pie. I thought you might celebrate. We might celebrate your arrival. I wanted you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pies for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. I shit over here too. This is it. Oh, show me. A room of your own. I hope you like it. I'm not a dog. Don't pet me, bitch. I love you. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Turned her on. You could also... If you can walk up to it, chances are pressing enter or Z will let you examine it. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. So be sure to examine the environment to fully immerse yourself. I'm gonna take a nap. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. It's mine. You can also go to items and hit enter on them and hit info to check them out. Butterscotch cinnamon pie, or butterscotch pie. All HP, oh god. It doesn't say a number, it just says all. Butterscotch cinnamon pie, one slice. Come on, give me more slices, mofo. Up already, I see? Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have somebody here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've already prepared a curriculum for your education. Sorry, I'm just taking my pants off. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still. Oh, Jesus. I'm glad to have you living here. Oh? Did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This is your home now. No. I was born in Cincinnati. Twit. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? How do I leave? Um... How about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails have chainsaw-like tongues called radula? I did not know that. That makes snails a hundred times more badass. Uh, interesting. How do you exit the ruins? Um, I have to go do something. I'm having a seizure. Please stay here. Mature gameplay here from Tom Tom 64 You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. One way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave here again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Well, I'm gonna say this is a good point to uh, cut it off. That was your preview of the game, haters. No, I'm just joking. I, I know you people are just skeptical. But that was your preview of the game. Um, if you like what you see, I really recommend spending the $10 to get this game. Because it is oh so very worth it. And if not, then be prepared to watch more of this because... I'm planning on doing all the runs. Every single ending. That I can manage, that is. Oh my lord. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you back. Actually, I hope to not see you back, because I really want you to play this game if you haven't already, but if you have played this game already, and you're watching this for fuck all reason, 
or you haven't played the game and you just want to just like really it, like you just hate yourself then i guess i will see you back goodbye for now everybody